dailies or sometimes dailies, quality adjusted life years or disability adjusted life years, um, which is a unit that attempts to compare different ways of affecting people. So life years is how long you live and quality adjusted is just how good it is. So it's much better to have nine years of superb uh, experience than ten years of misery, uh, for instance. So, if we have this unit, which has its problems, but imperfect as it is, uh, how effective is Kaposi's sarcoma's treatment? Well, for about a thousand pounds, you get slightly less than one uh, extra quaily, which is fine. I mean, if I had this, I would definitely be willing to pay more than a thousand pounds a year to <coughs> avoid it. But there are more effective interventions. Antiretroviral therapy, for instance, um, that gives you almost up to two quailies. But uh, as my mother and probably a lot of your mothers have uh, said, prevention is better than cure. So if you prevent the disease being transmitted during pregnancy, you get a much higher effect. Uh, this is partially an artifact that if a child it does not have AIDS, they won't have AIDS, well, the effect will last their lifetime, most likely. <coughs> what other preventions, let's scale these down a little bit. Uh, what other preventions are? Well, there's condom distribution, which is uh, quite well known. So that gets up to almost 20 quailites per thousand pounds. Now, this just looks like numbers, but what it means is that if you are going to send your money to a charity, and you send it here rather than here, this is the amount of death or disease that you are comfortable with by choosing the less efficient option. Now, it's a bit different. Maybe if you are a specialist carpalli sarcoma doctor yourself, then intervening there is maybe more efficient for you than intervening this end. But if you're thinking of charitable donations, inefficiency is quite literally death. And if you see the delay, so more than tw a factor of 20, that means that if you took 20 people who donate to charity and told 19 of them, we don't need your donations, and redirected the donation of the 20th, that would be an improvement over the status quo if they were donating to inefficient charities. But I've been talking about AIDS. Is AIDS really the most effective intervention? It turns out, as far as we can tell, that it's not. Anti-malaria is a more effective intervention, and the distribution of bed nets ranks currently towards the top in efficiency, so over 50 quailies per 1,000 pounds. Uh, so at that point, if you're thinking 50 quality adjusted life years, that's that's a, a lifetime. So we're getting to the level of saving entire human lives at this. These numbers are coming from Giving What We Can and GiveWell, a charity assessor 